The Art Museum is getting ready to kick off a summer camp for kids and teens. Courtney George joins us to talk about Art Ventures. How are you doing, Courtney? I am great. How are you? I'm good. Thank you so much for being here. So touch on that a little bit for us. What's going on? So every year we have this fun art camp that we want to encourage the community to get their kids signed up for. All classes are taught by professional artists in their respective mediums. So Professional sculptors are going to be teaching kids ceramic classes and clay classes and kids are going to actually be creating these masterpieces that aren't your typical drawings on, with pen and paper. They are going to be creating planners and coffee mugs and wearable art and all kinds of stuff. So we really want kids to get signed up for this awesome art class. So cool. And uh, how long do they have to get signed up for that? I know parents are listening. <laughs> they have until June 8th. Okay. So we really want, that's a Friday, we really want people to get their applications in. After that, there will be a $10 late fee. Okay. So there's still an opportunity, but class spa spaces fill up really fast. So we really want to encourage everyone to get signed up. And that's not the only thing happening, right? No, on a, even sooner, uh -huh. we're having our Family Arts Day, which is this Saturday, and it's going to be 10 to 2, and also a lot of fun art activities, except all these are free. <laughs> Everything is free at our Family Arts Day, free admission, free art activities like the ones I have in front of us. Okay, let's take a look at a couple of these. So give us an example of what the kiddos will be doing. Here, you want to wear that one? Yes. I can place it over your face. So this is just one of them. We have our cute little critter mask. These are cute. This is inspired inspired by one of our exhibitions that has a bunch of masks in it. Uh -huh. So kids will get to look at the exhibitions and the masks in the galleries and create their own and example of one. So And it's made out of like a paper plate it seems, right? right? So mm -hmm. really conventional material. There you go, yep. So cool. And we also have this little paper clip alligator. We call <laughs> it the gator biter. And like it. <laughs> one of our exhibitions has a bunch of alligators in okay. the paintings and everything. So kids are going to get to go into the gallery, search for these, and then create their own little alligator critter. And not only is this inspired by one of our exhibitions, but also the royal, the royal wedding, wedding coming up. <laughs> Kids will get to create their own crowns and actually will have a throne that oh they goodness. can sit in and parents can take pictures of them and everything. So it's it's going to be a What's lot of fun. What's the age limit? I feel like I need to take a picture there is no on the age royal limit. throne. <laughs> There's never an age limit for that. Yeah, we want to encourage all families to come out. It's going to be a lot of fun. All right, let's talk date, time, and location for folks who are interested. Yes, it's this Saturday, and it's going to start at 10, wrap up around 2, and it's on 500, it's 500 Main Street. And like I said earlier, admission is free. They can give us a call, 409-832-3432 for questions or visit, visit us at amset.org. Sounds good. Courtney, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. And when we come back, one Florida grandmother has her dream come true, and Justin Timberlake makes it all possible. <laughs> 